Hey guys, Heidi Easley here. Sorry, the lighting is really crazy. Let me back that up a minute. Hold on. Let me see. Sorry about that. Let me get the lighting right here. I'm going to do something cool with y'all tonight. Uh, first off, I just want to say hi. My name is Heidi Easley and I am on Essential Stencils page. And I'm going to be showing you something fun. But first, I wanted to give you a chance. If you love snowman, let me know if you love snowman. You can get this full video tutorial with the entire tracer and the supply list just by clicking on the link in the description. It will immediately give you access to it for free. So I created this for you today. So I want to let you know that you can have full access to it for free. Snowmen I know are a huge, am I doing that the right way? Here we go. I know snowmen are a huge hit right now. Well, they're always a huge hit, but I wanted to let you know um, that that is totally for free, and all you have to do is click the link, and then it'll go directly to your inbox. So, um, happy fall. <laughs> happy fall slash, you know, Christmas slash whatever. Okay, so I'm going to be creating a Merry Christmas. This is an easy, easy one. So what I did was I took... Uh, you know, just a six foot board and from this six foot board um oh yay I'm glad you're liking that hello from Oklahoma hey Christy hey Misty is it Misty or Missy hey Missy hey Michelle and Deborah and Nancy hey guys okay so I'm going to be taking hopefully my water won't fall off and um, a six foot board what I did was I went ahead and prepped it and did a glaze uh, um I like to use Van Dyke Brown and I did a um, glaze effect, so it's not a, um, what am I trying to say? <laughs> My brain is not working. Do y'all ever have those days when you're just, you're just, your brain is done. And you're just trying to, trying to get through the day, right? Um, it is a glaze effect from General Finishes. General Finishes glaze effect. And I'm going to be using the stencils, of course, from our favorite stencil company, Essential Stencil. And... Y'all's name, Essential Stencil, is so hard to say five times fast. Can y'all all say Essential Stencil five times fast? Every time I say it, I get tongue twisted. <laughs> okay, so we want to make sure we have the, the words right, and it's just a Merry Christmas sign. So here's kind of the cool thing. Because this is such a big board, which you could do this on a smaller board, you know, to be fine. But because this is such a big board, and um, I have room to get crazy with some of the extras that they send. So in this one, in this actual design, and you can click on the link, um, Deb says thanks for the snowman tutorial. Oh, you're so welcome. If you're just joining, I'm giving you this full tutorial for free, the tracers and the supply list. So if you want to do this full tutorial with me for free, and it's instant access. So as soon as you sign up, it goes straight to that light is freaking me out. As soon as it signs up, it gets, it gives you access straight to your inbox. Okay. And, um, but what comes with this stencil is some sunflower or, oh my, am I going to get through this slide? <laughs> Y'all going to help me if I can get through this. It comes with these stencils, the snowflakes. That's what I used for this. So you can see I used all these snowflakes to be a part of this one. So I wanted to let you know that was for free and then also give you kind of just a quick step-by-step. -step. Were y'all going to tell me that this was upside down? Come on, guys. We got to have each other's back. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to kind of show you. But before I do this, I want to put a bunch of stencils. So I'm going to take the one that it comes with. And then also, I wanted to show y'all this one because this is what inspired the snowmen was this is also one of essential stencils. Baby, it's cold outside. So originally, I was just going to do one snowman with Baby, it's cold outside. And I drew this one, and I didn't love him. And then I drew this one, and I loved this one. And so when I removed this, and I saw them together, I was like really happy. I was like, yes, it's a little pear. And so I wanted to still use all the snowflakes, so that's where I went from that stencil to this stencil. So... Guys, if you're teaching paint parties out there, let me know my paint party people. If you're teaching paint parties out there, bring stencils. It is so, so much fun and your customers will love it. So my paint party that I have tomorrow night, I will bring all of these stencils 
and let them just have fun. And they can add these things on top of the paintings that we're, we're already doing. Okay, so before I do the lettering, I'm going to go ahead and do some stencils. So sometimes you can whitewash over this. But since I'm doing a bunch of white snowflakes, I am not going to whitewash this time. Also, another little trick. This is what I use to spray all of my wood designs. So that this piece of wood will get sprayed with this. That it's just a clear gloss, it's 10 bucks at Lowe's. Um, this piece of wood will get sprayed with this. I'll just set it outside for a couple of hours. But when I teach paint parties, I just tell my customers to do that. I don't actually um, have them do it at the paint party or it's going to really, really smell pretty bad. Okay, let me see if I can sit down and this light gets a little... Man, I need to get one of those diffuser things. You know what I'm talking about? Let me do it that way. Maybe that's a little better. Sorry, guys. It's like my forehead is shining so bad. Oh, thank y'all for sharing. We have a lot of people in here. We have Judy from North Carolina, Brenda from Louisiana. Thanks so much for the snowman paint. You are welcome. I'm so excited to share that one. I think you're gonna love it. And um, flip your last stencil. Thank you for having my back, Peggy. Thank you so much. I'm gonna start having paint parties but only have three stencils. That's okay, Kim. Get started somewhere. You gotta start somewhere. Okay, so I'm gonna just click, um, click. Oh my gosh, I will get through this Facebook Live. <laughs> we will get this painting done tonight, and then I'm going to share. <laughs> I just gotta take a drink. Let's all take a deep breath. Whew. It has been a day. It has been one of those days. Um, <laughs> so what was I trying to say? Oh my gosh. You know, you have those days where it's just... Nothing's going to come out right. So we don't know how this Facebook Live is going to go. But my goal is to have this finished and ready to put on my porch, okay? That is my goal. And then at the end, I'm going to announce um, a couple of winners. And Essential Stencil is going to send you some gifts, okay? So um, those of you that are sprinkling the love, I just want to say thank you. And then as you're commenting at the end, I'll just pick a couple of people. Um, let's see. We have... Hey Heidi, hopped right over after paint party headquarters. Yeah, we just did a, an hour and a half long Facebook Live in my paint party headquarters group. And so um, maybe that's why my, my brain is still focused on, you know, answering their questions and, you know, ways I can help them. And so I, I think my brain is still like on the other live. So I just want to say I'm sorry. So here's my free gift for my crazy live tonight. You can have this exact video tutorial of this in addition to the supply list that tells you the exact size and everything you need for that look, okay, for those snowmen. Okay, so what you're going to do is I like to use these cheap brushes. You can get them at Michael's or um, Lowe's anywhere. And then I just take my stencil and I dip it on here. And I know there's some fancier stencil people out there. I'm just not a fancy stencil person. I just love stencils. So I just get it wet and then I dab it. And then I just go up and down. And I'm not a person who's like majorly perfectionist. So a little out of the, the lines for me does not hurt my feelings. Um, but this weekend I taught a youth group. It was a youth group party and it was girls. They were all about probably 14, 15 years old. And one of the girls there, she was insanely amazing at using these stencils. So like I said, anytime I teach paint parties, I bring my stencils with me because you just never know where they're gonna wanna add stencils. So even like my door hangers, and here's what I do between. I just kinda wipe off the back. I don't wipe off the front because that's a disaster, right? I just kinda wipe off the back so I can keep going and then I go to the next set, the next area. But anyway, this girl, I think she was 14 or 15, and oh my goodness, she was so good at stencils. She took, I'm just gonna kinda place these. She took some of them and she took a really small brush. So some of y'all you know, that have more time and wanna do that, you could use a smaller brush and go really, really slow 
And when you go really slow like that and make sure you don't go up under the stencil, it's gonna give it a really good crisp look. Now, when she came to me and showed me her design at the end, I was like, girl, if you are not doing this for a living, you should. Because I was so impressed with what she had done. And, um, and it, was, it was so good. I was like, you went really slow, didn't you? And she goes, yeah. And you could tell I me mean, we had like two and a half hours working and that girl like spent the time going so super slow. Um, let's see, we have Teresa, first time watching it. Oh my gosh, yeah, who has um who is this the first time with? Um, let me know who the first time is watching. I would love to know. And then welcome. So my name is Heidi. I am taking over Essential Stencils page today to show y'all some of their stencils. And I actually teach people how to make money teaching paint parties. And so as my free gift for you today, you can get the snowman tutorial, step-by-step -step, me teaching you exactly how to paint this in addition to a supply list and you get the tracer. So you don't even have to freehand this, you can just print and trace. And I show you exactly how to do that and you get instant access. So if you want that tutorial, just, um, click the link in the description and you can go directly to that tutorial and get it right away for free. So it's a total free gift for me and then it has the exact steps that you're gonna need to do and the supply list. And I think the tutorial is about 45 minutes long and it walks you directly through exactly what colors I use, everything. And then it'll show you how I use these stencils that I'm using right now to get that effect. So I think you'll love it, especially, is anybody on here a snowman fan? Do we have any snowmen, snowmen, snowman, <laughs> how is it, snowman fans? And I'm just warning you, if you are new to me or new to um, watching me live, I'm kind of a uh, klutz, so I'm just going to say it right now. Um, so I just want to apologize in advance for anything that happens on this live <laughs> because as I was doing it earlier I'd already messed up like 12 times so please I am human please give me some grace um as I would hope you would give other people grace um please give me some grace sometimes I mess up and sometimes I ramble so um I apologize but I am getting the painting ready for you so I'm just taking again the stencils that came in the Christmas one the Merry Christmas, and I'm just putting these all over here. And I use a brown, well, uh, um, oh, this is what I was talking about earlier. I'm having trouble speaking. My, my brain and words are not matching up. I used a, gl a glaze effects from Van Dyke Brown. Can I get all those words out? A glaze effects from Van Dyke Brown. That's it. Okay, got it. All right, so I'm just kind of trying to get these random here, and then we'll put the Merry Christmas on top. And this is an easy, easy thing to do. This would also be fun, y'all, if you, um, okay, so I don't know about y'all, but sometimes when we just go into a store to get gifts for people, it just seems like the same old stuff, right? Sometimes it just gets, like, really old. How cool would it be to... You know, if you have a crafty friend, to order them stencils for Christmas. Um, I would be so happy. I'm that person that if I got stencils for Christmas, I would be so, so happy. Because I think sometimes we, you know, we always get those gifts from people that we're like trying to like, you know, they're staring at you when they're opening, like when you're opening it and you're like, I love it. <laughs> and you're... Y'all know what I'm talking about. I know I'm not the only one. Like, you're, they're staring at you, and you got to open it right in front of them, and you got to pretend like it's the best gift you've ever received. And, yeah, it's hard to do sometimes. But when people get me stuff like this, there is no pretending. Like, I know if I got a stencil packet, I would be so happy because there's just something about stencils. I mean, it's like... It makes you always feel like an artist or a crafter. It just makes you feel like you're doing something good, you know? Like right now, I'm so happy about the way this wood is coming out. Um, so yeah, don't be acting like I'm the only one that has to pretend like, oh, I love that gift. 
thank you. Like, I like it when people give me a gift and then they they just let me go open it by myself. Like, I just like that a lot. <laughs> My husband sometimes, oh, here's, oh, that's looking good. I like it. Okay. My husband sometimes, um, and I, I'm, my husband, I love him so much. Don't get me wrong. I love him so, so much. And um, we've been married 22 years, 22. Yeah. I think we just hit 22. Anyway, um, I got married when I was really young. Got married when I was a baby. No, <laughs> I, I turned 18 and literally two weeks later got married. And so, um, so he will try to get me jewelry and like, I am a jewelry person. Like I love earrings and I love stuff like this. And so, um, he just, his taste in jewelry and my taste in jewelry is totally different. And so, um, he'll get me like jewelry and he'll think that I really like it, you know, cause I love turquoise, but then he'll get me this like kind of strange turquoise stuff. And I'm just like, I love it. I love it. <laughs> but I don't love it. I don't love it. But if he would buy me these stencils, yes, let me, let me, honey, do the earring picking out. You just buy me the stencils. So for those of y'all that are thinking of maybe getting a friend or somebody crafty a gift, this would be a great Christmas gift. And um, so yeah, you can get, oh, you can use my link. I would love that. It's in the comments. And then also, um, <laughs> Kelly says, you're too cute. You know, we've all reacted that way too for a gift. Yes, I am not the only one. <laughs> I know, Linda, I got married when I was a baby. And thank you. I'm getting, when you see me like up close, you can see the wrinkles. I'm trying to hide them, but it doesn't work. Um, okay, so for those of y'all that are just joining, I'm giving you this as a gift. Um, so basically all you have to do is click the link in the description. You will get this free. It's a full tutorial. Well, not. I'm not going to ship this to you. You have to actually paint your own, but it's a full video tutorial. I am cracking myself up tonight. <laughs> Y'all might not be feeling it on that side, but I think I just have the giggles tonight. I don't know what is wrong with me. I think I'm getting delirious. I think, I think that's really what it is. I'm starting to get delirious. So anyway, you, I made this for you today. So you can um, click on the link in the description. You'll get the whole supply list. I even made tracers for you. So all you have to do is print them out. Once you print them out, you just use black carbon paper and then you can actually trace it onto your board. I have the exact size board you need along with the step-by-step -step videos. And then we use essential stencil stencils in there for the snowflakes. Because here's the thing, I could have done just the dots for snow, but it wouldn't look near as cute if I wouldn't have added the snowflakes. Like the snowflakes are, I think really what makes it. I'll show y'all close a little bit. And then I use some metallic paints too. And I'm, I started adding glitter. See the glitter shining? I started adding some glitter, but I'm gonna go back and add a ton more glitter. So anyway, in that free gift, you can click on the link in the description. You'll be able to get, they were about to attack me. You'll be able to get all of that. Okay, let's see. Oh, there we go. Already dropping stuff. All right, let's see if there's any questions. Is it just for the winners? No, Teresa, this is a free gift for everybody. Everybody gets this if you click on the link. It's an instant download. Um, it'll take you directly to the unlisted video that I have that I just made for y'all. So this is for y'all. Um, and then feel free to sh sprinkle the love. I know we're not supposed to say share. Oh, crap. I always do that. I say we're not supposed to say share, and then I say share when I'm cool. I gotta stop saying that word. So sprinkle the love. <laughs> and then also I'm gonna be picking somebody here in just a minute. Um, and I just wanna warn all of y'all that are just now joining. I am a basket case tonight. I just wanna be real upfront and clear. Um, I think I'm delirious today. So I just wanna say, please give me some grace. And as soon as I get this going, then I'm going to finish this up and announce a winner. I think we have another really cool stencil from Essential Stencil. Hold on guys. Don't look at my mess. I see y'all looking at my mess over there. Are y'all looking at it? Christmas ones from Essential Stencil. I wanted to see. Oh, yes, it will. The reindeer. 
Yay, because I have so much room on here, I feel like I can make this reindeer fit too. Okay, guys. And sometimes you just got to go with, when you have a, an idea, just go with it. Okay? So I'm going to add the reindeer, and then we have the Mary. Hello? Nobody's in here. It sounded like it. Okay, let's see. Yay! Okay, so this deer is sold. This deer is sold separately, but it's still an essential stencil too. All right, so I'm going to put this on here, and I'm going crazy. I'm going to use my favorite paint in the world. If you know me, you know this is my favorite paint. You can probably go ahead and put it in the comments because you know which one I'm about to use. Um, it is the 24 karat gold from Deco Art Americana. It's my absolutely favorite paint of all time. I use it on pretty much anything and everything I can use. And you will be surprised, I did not use it on this one. Still kicking myself, I don't know why I didn't. I'll probably add to it, just because I feel like this has to be on everything. So it's better if you really hold down your stencil and make sure, I'm gonna kinda just go into it because I can clean up the edges if it gets a little crazy. But the reason I love this gold, okay, can you see it now? And the reason I love this gold is it's so, like it just, some golds I've used in the past don't show up. But this one is really, really good. Like it shows up and it's got such a beautiful color. Um, and if you don't love like the bright gold like I do, which I, I fell in love with it and I use it all the time. I think I go through one of these like every month. I go through a whole jar of this every month because I use it for everything. And those of you that didn't see it, let me go ahead and show you again. It's the 24 karat gold. Um, oh, Cheryl, you definitely need to try stenciling. How many of y'all on here um, feel like you could do this? Okay, and let me know because again, guys, it was literally just a base, a base color with a stain. I literally just took this and went back and forth. And then all I'm doing is stenciling. I'm doing no freehanding. So these stencils you can get, my link is in the description. You can get them um, shipped out. They always ship them out in these really beautiful packages that have like the, they always have these really cool black pieces in them. Um, I don't know why they send it with this, but I love it. Please do not stop sending these because I use them for fun. Like I draw on them. I do all kinds of fun stuff with them. So please don't stop sending those. I love those. Um, but yeah, you can totally do this. So let me know if you think you can do this. Um, beautiful me, me. Yes, you can. You can totally do this. And then if you want to try to like paint, paint with stencils, then try the tutorial. So again, that tutorial is totally free for you. And there is no charge, you get instant access to it. All you have to do is click on the link in the description and then I'm gonna give you a video that shows step-by-step -step, plus the tracers plus the supply list of exactly how to do that. So I just want y'all to have some happy snowman in your life because they make me very happy. So I want them to make y'all happy too. Okay, so I put a little layer of gold on here I'm gonna let this dry a minute. This part, I want a little bit thicker. Okay, and I might have to do like a little highlight line. Let's see. Ooh, nice. Okay, so I just pulled that off. Set that somewhere to dry. Let me see, can y'all see that? Looks really cute. I think I may do, I wonder if my red is thick enough to do this. Let's see, if I do red with a little bit of black, not much, just a tad, I think it'll be dark enough to make the Merry Christmas. Let's see if this will work. I'm just gonna, let me rinse my gold a little bit. We don't know what'll, what'll happen with all of that mixture. Let's see. Okay, so I'm just gonna mix this a little bit. just to get it a little bit darker, and then I'll come back over it with a little bit brighter. All right, so Merry Christmas. Is it all spelled right and turned the right way? Can y'all tell? 
I just want to make sure it's nothing worse than that. <laughs> hey, Sandra from Michigan. Let's see. Yes, we might be getting snow here already. Oh my gosh. Okay, so you're going to laugh, Susan, but we had our cold front in Texas and it went from 98 degrees to like 88 degrees. And we're all like, I got out my sweater today. <laughs> it was, yeah, we're crazy. But yeah, we, we don't have a lot of cold, cold until a little bit later. Um, let's see. Oh, and a red nose. Oh, that would be cute. Linda says, you are really, really good at this. Oh, thank you. That was so sweet. Um, what kind of paint? Okay, so I am using Deco Art Americana. This is my favorite of all times. And then I'm using... Um, this one is a berry red. I think I'll put in this one though. Nope, I did not. I think I put in berry red. So berry red, I'm gonna put a little bit more. Maybe I won't have to do two coats. I need to order more berry red. It's running out. All right, thank y'all so much for joining. And those of y'all that are sprinkling the love across Facebook, um, we are very, very grateful. And I was talking to y'all about earlier about how you could use these stencils and actually buy somebody for Christmas a stencil pack. And what I've been trying to do is get my Christmas presents earlier this year so that I'm not waiting. One year I waited till like December 23rd to buy gifts. I was much younger, but I waited so long. It was ridiculous. So this year, I'm trying not to do that. I'm trying to like have fun with the, the buying of the gifts because you know, no matter what's going on, there's always like certain people that you just always buy for. You know, like your mom or your dad or you know, people in your life that you just every year they're always on your list. Well, I always try to think like what could I do different? Whether it's make something, like what if you were to make them one of these signs? How cool would that be? Um, what if you were to take the free tutorial I gave you and make them that? Like maybe you have a friend or a family member who loves snowmen. You could get the free tutorial today and actually make that and have plenty of time to have it to them before Christmas. So, you know, there's so many different ways of like being thoughtful this season than just like run into nothing against Bed Bath & Beyond, but instead of just run into Bed Bath & Beyond and picking up something that you get two for three, you know, whatever. You can actually be like a little bit more thoughtful and intentional and either make them something or if they're a crafty type person, actually buy them a stencil. Um, I don't know, I would just love that as a gift. Hint, hint, everybody, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I have a lot of stencils, but I still buy more. I still buy stencils pretty much every month. <laughs> Whether it's from a central stencil or when I'm just everywhere. I just love it. And I, I have my own vinyl cutter, so I make my own stencils too. And I still go out and buy them. So that has, that has something to be said. I'm the paint party lady who teaches people how to make money teaching paint parties. And I have a giant daddy vinyl stencil cutter right there. And I still, still buy essential stencil stencils. So that should tell you something right there. Okay, so I'm just adding this blackish reddish to my wood, and if it doesn't pop enough, I'll just do a quick highlight line, and then in just a few minutes, I'm gonna pick a winner. So thank y'all so much for commenting and sprinkling the love. And then also, if you have a friend who loves snowmen, now is their chance. Tag them and let them know that this snowman tutorial is for free. I hardly ever do like a prepared tutorial like that for free. I do those for my paint party headquarters. My um, group, we have almost 800 members in there and I do that for them every single month. But I hardly ever, I don't even know the last time I've given away a tutorial with supply list and all the things needed for it. Um, I can't even tell you when I've done that. <laughs> so it's definitely something, something I wanted to do for y'all and I hope that you'll take advantage of it while it's available to you for free. So all you have to do is click the link in the description and you'll be able to grab that today. And it will go to your inbox. Now this is the tricky part, y'all. It likes to go hide in your junk folders, in your spam, or in your promotion folders. I don't know why it does that, but these snowmen like to hide. So if you have signed up for it and you're like, Heidi, that's great, but I don't see it in my email, 
it's like a little scavenger hunt. <laughs> it's a snowman scavenger hunt. You gotta go find it, okay? Find it in your email and then you'll have access to it and you'll have a um, direct download to get the supply list of exactly what um, I used, what paints I used, what stencils of essential stencil I used, and um, of course the tracer, which is probably the biggest bonus. I know the tutorial is great, but the tracer, because you'll be able to get this exact picture and then use my um, supply list, you'll be able to get the exact colors. But I thought, I almost did that during the tutorial and you'll hear me talk about it, but wouldn't it be cool to do this or the scarves as like buffalo plaid? So you could make this like non-Christmassy by doing buffalo plaid, like black and white or doing golds or different colors on the scarves. So it just looks wintry and not Christmassy. Um, I thought that would be really, really cool to do. Okay, we're almost ready to pull these up. You want to see them? Okay, let's see. Let's see what they look like. Okay, I'm hoping they have a good contrast. This is the part you just never know. It's like that Christmas present, like hoping you show your face that you like it. Well, this is hoping that it works out in front of a whole audience. Dang it, I'm about to do a highlight line. Okay, it's okay. It's all okay, people. I can still do a highlight line and make it pop. All right, so we got our base, people. We got our base going. I'm just setting these out to dry. I'm gonna show you really quick what it looks like before I do my highlight line. And then you can, um, I'll show you just a little quick tip on doing really fast highlight lines. Okay, so this is what we got so far. Cute, I'm liking it. And then now I'm gonna take some gold, my favorite gold, and one of my favorite brushes. And I'm just gonna quickly add in a highlight line and show you how it can go pretty fast too, especially when you get used to it. Um, let's see, it almost looks three dimensions. I love the buffalo check I did too. I know, I, I was going to do that on the hat. And then as I started looking at it, I thought if I do, the buffalo plaid on the hats too, with all those designs on the scarf, it would get too, too busy. So I chose not to do that, but I kind of want to redo it. <laughs> now that I've done one, I kind of want to do another one. And uh, let's see, glitter on the letters. Yes, Renee, I like where your head's at. So definitely glitter on the letters. Um, ugh, I'll have to let it dry to have glitter. Let me see if y'all can see this a little better. Is that better or worse? Oh, hold on. Let me move around a little bit. Let me move this. Okay, I think y'all can see it a little better. Is that better? Okay, so I'm gonna use this. This is a size four, just a, a round size four. You can also use a liner brush. And then you can highlight this in any color you want. So I'm just gonna do gold because I have this giant gold deer, which I'm really, really excited about. And then I always try to do like kind of outer and under, you know, like left and under. So there's not really, you just don't want to outline the whole thing unless you need to. So if it looks like it's not going to show up at all, like if it was too blended in, then I might outline, outline the whole thing. But I'm just grabbing some gold paint and then just quickly doing under and then on the left side, okay? So I'll do this kind of fast. And a tip, if you shake, like when I drink a lot of coffee, and I'll actually use my pinky as kind of a balance for me. So kind of an under. So it just depends on how you feel comfortable. So sometimes if I have my wrist in a good position, it'll hold it steady because I do kind of shake because I'm, I'm kind of a hyper person and I drink a lot of coffee, so I'll have those jitters. But um, I just kind of take it and go with it really close to it. Let me know in the comments if you like seeing stuff like that, like this. If you like seeing like lettering, and let's see, side, side, side. 
have to make sure I'm doing the right, the right ones. Let me scoot it up so y'all can see me work a little better. I'm probably going to take down the whole kit and caboodle. Let me see. Hopefully. Oh, my art studio is a disaster. <laughs> it's so messy. Okay, let's see. The side. So we'll go on this side. Well, I just covered it with my arm. I'm trying to get the right sides, but I don't want to... It's hard for me to see. i got to get from this side. Left, down, left, down. And then maybe I'll just do a little bit right here. Okay? I'll go this way so y'all can watch it a little bit better. And I'm just going right up to the edge. These stencils, um, even with me using a big brush and not being really specific, um, still had a good outcome. So sometimes stencils are kind of flimsy. These are thick enough that you can kind of be rough with them and they don't just bleed everywhere, um, which I, I love that so much. Because I'm not a perfectionist painter and I, I'm not a patient. Like I just, I like to feel it. I like to paint and go with it. So if I have to sit there and be too tedious, it's not fun for me. So I like to be more just you know have fun and go for it and I like that these stencils allow that allow a bit a little bit of imperfection for us that don't want to be too too perfectionist about it all right who downloaded the snowman already before I get off in a minute make sure you've downloaded the free gift for the snowman and the link if you're looking for it is in the description so make sure you tag your snowman. Everybody has a friend who has everything snowman. You know, there's always somebody in a family or friend that has everything snowman or don't tag them and then paint it for them and surprise them. It'd be a great Christmas present. Okay, left, that's all that one needs. And this red is still wet. I'm doing it, you know, fast just so y'all can see it, but if you were doing this at home, you could always do like a blow dryer and get it a little bit dry first. And then also another tip, if you're doing this as a paint party, so I recommend charging around $65 for these at paint parties because you're going to pay, depending on where you're at, around $15 to $16 a board. And then plus your stencil supplies which yes, you can reuse, but you're still paying for them, right? Plus your stencil supplies. So I usually, for about 10 people, I charge 65 a person. And then um, I'll have like three sets of these stencils. That way people can share them. I can't believe my dog hasn't come in to visit us. He's usually He's usually in here hanging out. Does anybody have any um, fur babies that paint with them? I would love to know. We are a huge dog, dog family here. Okay, just adding this gold. So everything is red, gold, and white. Almost done, and I'll show you all up close and pick a couple of winners. Thank you all for hanging out with me tonight. This has been fun, and thanks for um, <laughs> not giving up on me earlier. I was, I was losing it, wasn't I? I don't know what was going on. I just got, I think I was just still, still on the other live or on the other call. I don't know what, what got into me, but I could not think straight to save my life. If you missed it, you can go back. It's quite funny. <laughs> okay, almost done, guys. I'm just doing this one little area, and then I'll show you up close. And then if any of y'all are wanting to get that snowman, make sure you get the link right now, because it'll be something you'll go, dang it, I should have got that free snowman painting right here, and then you'll forget 
and then you won't get it. So make sure you go click on the link before you forget and you'll get the video directly in your inbox. Okay, let's see. Okay, let me show you all this up close. And then another tip I would recommend highly is this, adding Deco Art Craft Twinkles. It's a crystal and I put it on everything, like even my ceramics that I do. Um, this is a truck and tree we're doing at a paint party. I actually use the glitter. This is one that's almost finished. Snowtex and glitter for this too. Um, Snowtex would actually be really fun to do on this as well. And let me know in the comments if you've ever used Snowtex. Okay, so we have the deer. And again, the deer is from, oh, it's kind of heavy. The deer is from Essential Stencil as well. And then I just did this, um, basically the stain I did the snowflakes and then I went in with the deer stencil as well as a little line. So you can see the line. Oh my gosh, I need to lift some weights because I have no, I have no arm, upper body strength. Hold on, let me do this before I knock down everything. Let me go over here. Okay, let me see if y'all can see it. Like in its full stand up. Okay, so you can see how tall it is. Six foot. So it's a really, really tall sign. And this would be perfect, again, to spray with the polyurethane and put it outside your door. All right, guys, I just want to say thank you all so much for painting with me. I'm going to pick a couple of winners. Okay, let's see who it is. Let's do the drum roll. Drum roll, I'm going to pick a couple of winners. And then you need to message Essential Stencil and say, I won. Send me my prize, please, and they will send it to you. Um, oh, thank you all so much. I think I really like that one, too. I love it. It's really pretty. And it kind of has that Texas A&M look. Ooh, my brother would really like that. Okay, um, and guys, just one last call. If you want to get the full video tutorial on how to paint this, along with the tracers, exact step-by-step, -step, and your supply list, make sure you download. And the free gift, it's in the link in the top. And just click that link and it will be automatically sent to your inbox and you'll have instant access to it. Oh, thank you, Deborah. She says, beautiful, Heidi Easley. Thank you. Okay, let me go ahead and announce the winners. I'm going to announce one. Milena Helton, you are number one. Okay, I'm going to pick one more. Let's see here. We have Betty Henson, number two. Congratulations. Oh, thank you, Brenda, for loving my earrings. I was talking about my earrings earlier. <laughs> All right, so we have two people, Betty Henson and Milena Helton. If you would please, please, please um, message Essential Stencil. They're going to give you something for free. They're going to send it to you. And then also, all of y'all that are watching, everybody is going to get this for free, but you got to click the link. Um, it's going to ask for your email address, and then it's going to send you that full tutorial of the snowman. And make sure you order it. Like, if you don't want to do this yourself, which would be awesome, and um, make sure you order somebody that is crafty some stencils this year. Um, I just know they're going to love it. They don't have to be like awkward at Christmas. Like if they're crafty and they're a DIY person, they are going to love this gift from you. So make sure that you order them some essential stencils. And um, guys, I just want to say thank you all so much for joining me. Thanks for being here. And I hope you love the snowman tutorial. All right. Have a great night. Bye.